tell me a bit about your relationship life. Have you had a significant one that you'd consider? I had three girlfriends so far in the past. And I think the last relationship that discontinued was because I wanted to settle and she did not want to. I think at that point, it made more sense to think logically than emotionally. So you're saying you're ready for more stability. You're ready for something more serious. When you think about a partner, what's most important to you in the long-term partner you're seeking? I don't think I'm much of a picker in terms of a lot of the other things. I think those are the main two qualities, like being ambitious and taking care of what it would be family. Do you have thoughts on anything that's more or less important to you foundationally? Definitely. It's uh, the first thing that anyone takes into consideration before getting to know each other. I wouldn't want to date someone very young or very old because that will change the outcome or where we're going with the relationship. So yeah, I'm attracted to different type of individuals. Mm -hmm. So you ever just like, are my standards too high? Or maybe I don't know them at all. This is a real thing. So I want you to do the mirror test and this is how you can do it. I want you to make a T-chart and on the left side, I want you to write down five must-haves, the five things that you absolutely need in a partner or in a relationship. Now, on the right side, I want you to go down that list and ask yourself, do I actively bring these things to the table? If the answer is yes, then you're good. You're clear to be asking for them. If the answer is no, then it is time to reevaluate and check your standards, friend.